I first and second uh, sent Ponix. Uh, basically, it's the IAVS uh, aquaponics system. Uh, this is the first one, and I built uh, two months ago. Um, uh, yeah, just testing, right? So looks pretty good. Uh, you know, everything grow very fast inside. This is tomato, two tomatoes. Uh, plants, uh, so lettuce, uh, you know, there's this pep green pepper, there's uh, beans out there, uh, more lettuce, okay. Uh, uh, so, yeah, this is the first one, this is the fish tank. Uh, right now, actually, the it's pumping water into the fish tank. So then gravity will push the water out through this pipe, uh, you know, along, and then come out from here. Uh, you can see, yeah, yeah. Um, see the water coming coming out, and then flow to through the side and the middle. Uh, and then come in here, come in here, and then drain to the bottom. I use, um, uh, I, I, I drill two holes at the bottom and then uh, fit with this uh, elbow. Uh, turn out that I don't need to do that, I could do simply leave a slot at the bottom, you know. So the second one, uh, I actually did that, right? Uh, okay, this is basically, um, so the sand as, acts as a physical filter and biofilter. Uh, I use a, a play sand, uh, which turned out to be too fine. Um, so this means that the the draining is slow. Uh, in the beginning, it's uh, it's fast, but as it can't get more compact, and then uh, 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 slow. So uh, as a result, water you know uh, gather you know on the surface to this level, so which is not good actually over the. Uh, the rim of the uh, of the poly uh, yeah poly film. Uh, anyway, this is uh, you know so the first one I just you know ch check to see how it works right and uh, so it turned out to be very good. I could uh, I actually use the sand to cultivate. Uh, uh, many things, basically seedling, you know, um, the sweet potato and just stuck into the sand and then it continues to produce shoots, right? And then I can use and uh, again and again. Uh, and this is tomato, I just, you know, this is the, I prone the tomato, right? Uh, branches, I, I just simply stuck into the sand and then it, it will produce uh, uh, roots, lots of roots, uh, you know, this way. Yeah, this is another piece of the, you know, tomato. Anyway, this is the first set. The first set, I, yeah, turn out the fish tank, tank uh, 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 appeared to be uh, too, a little bit low, so the draining is uh, not that fast. Uh, so then, and also the, the this, you know, uh, this draining uh, uh, opening, um, uh, drainage opening, uh, kind of a, you know, I, I, I turn out, I, I, I could add, simply add slot at the bottom, you know, that drains faster. This way, there's always some water, you know, uh, accumulating at the 
uh, uh, the bottom. So that's why I made a second one just a few days ago. Uh, this is a fish tank. Uh, you can see slightly higher. Uh, yeah, because everything is higher. Uh, uh, same thing. Uh, you see the, the water is pumping in, and then the gravity flows. You know, the water flows through this pipe. This time I make uh, uh, you know uh, place the pipe uh, the pipe in the middle. So it just drain and coming out from here. You can see, see, uh, it's coming out at the bottom. Um, and then, you know, flow at the, along the side and then in the middle and, and gather here. Um, this time, yeah, I, I made slot uh, at the bottom. Uh, I make sure I wrap everything with poly so the water won't leak into the wood. So this time it's, yeah, uh, this way the wood is remain to be dry all the time. Um, yeah, same thing, uh, I use clay sand which turned out to be too fine. See, the uh, drain flow rate is much faster, was much faster in the beginning. But now, you know, once, uh, you know, everything settles down and become contact, I mean the sand, and then, uh, you know, the, the drain, the drainage uh, is slow. So you see it's the water gather here, which is, uh, the next time I make sure I mix, uh, mix uh, clay sand with something else, uh, you know, uh, higher grid, so that the, the sand won't, won't be too, too fine like this but anyway you know I grow see this is relatively new uh, you know I just this is just a uh, you know lattice uh, you know a uh, greenhouse lattice we, we bought and there's lots of roots so I just stuck into the sand and now uh, it, it just everything it's just everything you see is is, is new uh, it's you know uh, and we already uh, Ate some, and there's some other things. Uh, again, I use it to cultivate uh, seedlings. You know, I just either uh, you you know plant by, by you know plant the seeds, or just stuck the branches, you know, cuttings, you know, into the sand, and then uh, everything uh, grow faster. Because this is a greenhouse in the summertime, uh, the you know the greenhouse temperature. Um, see here right now, it's uh, yeah 30, 32 degrees yeah, Celsius. Uh, so yeah, this second one, um, the the drainage. Uh, you know, it will two hour drain. Uh, you know, if you learn that uh, I is uh, uh, the drainage time is two hours. Uh, basically, every two hours you pump, you, you use the timer to pump the, the water uh, and then pump for 10 minutes and stop. Uh, for my system, because the sand is too fine, so I, I pump eight minutes. Um, and this one, I just set it up. I haven't put the fish uh, out of feeder yet. Uh, it's here. I need to buy fish food and, uh, and put it there. Okay, so this is it. Um, high ABS. Very simple. Very simple. Uh, you basically you, you can simply set it and forget it, uh, and then everything just run. Automatically, you know, I just use um, one pump 
for each system. Um, uh, this one got three uh, sub tanks. Uh, um, the, the pump sitting right there, over there, yes. and then this two black water. Um, so the water pump from there to the fish tank. Okay. Uh, this one, the, the same thing, uh, these two collect water, but this is actually a full tank. Um, I buried uh, a full uh, rim barrel, uh, you know, halfway, so that collect can store more water. Yeah. Um, uh, the sub tank is behind uh, the behind uh, this this uh, uh, barrel uh, you can now see it's on the other side but anyway and uh, this one also have a, a heat recycling system uh, basically another separate system uh, see the water is right there uh, it's uh, you know basically uh, let the water uh, you know be pumped to uh, to this, you can now see to this uh, barrel, uh, and then there's a um, uh, uh, pipe, you know, uh, very thick, you know, big pipe, uh, and then the air is drawn from the roof, okay? The air is drawn from the roof, this is the end, uh, actually drill holes, right? So, because uh, the idea is uh, the higher uh, the the air temperature at the, at the rooftop is is higher, so I drain I draw the air through this you know this pipe big pipe, and then let it run through uh, you know run through this uh, curled inside uh, in through the, uh, the 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 tank. Uh, there's water outside the, the pipe, right? So the, the heat exchange happens. So basically to uh, draw hot air and then cool it with water and so the, so the heat can be transferred into uh, water. Uh, that's the idea, okay? And then um, uh, this way, um, so the water acts as thermal mass and also sand sand acts as a thermal mass so both as uh, acts as therm thermal mass so the idea is to collect heat uh, enough heat to be released during the night yeah the night I simply close the, the door uh, you know and then then the whole system released heat slowly so that uh, in the the nighttime uh, temperature won't be too too low. So that the basic idea is to keep the uh, the greenhouse temperature uh, higher than before. Yeah, and not du just during the day. During the day for sure. Yeah, but uh, during the night. Yeah, you know. So it's kind of a yeah. This is a uh, so basically on the right hand side there's two systems. One is for uh, heat recycle, uh, heat uh, storage. Uh, the other is the IAVS uh, aquaponics uh, system. Okay, so that's it. Uh, hope you like it and uh, very simple. Hope you can do it. Uh, you know, it's uh, very simple. I don't need to get into any technical detail. As long as you know that you use the sand as biofilter and physical filter and uh, you know just use it as, as grow media and, and then everything else uh, is the same as uh, uh, aquaponic but there's a big difference uh, uh, for sure uh, basically the pumping water yeah the frequency is very slow uh, very very low i mean just uh, every two hours we, you pump the water and only for eight to ten minutes right and then you stop. So you know, the, 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 basically, the the time to run the pump is very short. You know, just ten minutes uh, every two hours, and then stop. 
and then let everything drain and then get let air get into the sand and the bacteria like it so the bacteria will turn the fish pool into uh, fertilizer uh, into nitrate okay so that's uh, how it is uh, very simple uh, hopefully you can build one uh, yourself